Hey guys, what's up? I'm here to give you guys a recap on the new episode of Digimon Adventure on episode 12 or Digimon Adventure 2020 on episode 12. Anyways, this episode right here, not too bad. It looks like to me we get some small spotlight for a certain Digimon, but if anything else, let's just get this started. Mimi, who fell down in a trap hole or something, is trying to figure out how to get out, you know, and reunite with Taichi and the others. Unfortunately for them, they will be followed by Sam Bergermon, and Mimi will later on dust off a certain part that might be dead or something. And we have to that's that that's that the Sam Bergermon will later on activate Andromon, which will later on be revealed an ultimate type digi ultimate type Digimon, and later on cause um some havoc on Mimi. And Togemon did not stand a chance against it since it's a it's an ultimate level, which was later on revealed. But we have to it that Mimi and Palmon will later on be rescued by a Gardromon. Which apparently, because Mimi wiped up, wiped off some dust and it later on be activated because it touched it or wiped it off or something. We have to it that um, it helped Mimi escape. While Taichi and Izzy are trying to find Mimi, they will later on be attacked by a group of Digimon named Haguro, Haguromon, you know? And eventually, Gardramon will later on bond with Mimi for a bit and tries to lead her to an elevator where she could go up, you know? And even though, like, um, it's very happy to see Mimi smiling and wants to give it its best to help her out because it helped it, because it awakened him, you know? Unfortunately, Gardramon will later on have to take Andromon one more time despite having to use some kind of object to make to fall on Andromon. Andromon, who is manipulated, continues to try to eliminate Mimi, you know? Because it's the target. While Gardramon is giving its best to like protect Mimi, unfortunately, it'll get knocked out, you know? And later on, before Mimi was about to be attacked or eliminated, we had to that Kabuterimon shows up and pushes Andromon, Andromon out of the way. But we see to it that Taichi is having his hands full to fight the Harugumon. Eventually, Kabuterimon will later on be defeated and... Greymon shows up to like him um, fight Andromon, but because it's kind of too much for Greymon to handle, he will later on trans super evolve to Metal Greymon. But unfortunately, because Greymon's size and the area they are fighting in, Andromon's speed gets the better of gets gives him the advantage, and of course ends up using missile launch rapid fire and ends up causing a, a lot of debris fall down. You know, eventually with Grey Metal Greymon being distracted and Togemon try with Palmon awaken later and evolve to Togemon, they are trying to hold the debris up so it doesn't fall on the kids and everyone together. Andromon takes advantage of the situation and tries to eliminate Mimi, but unfortunately for him, Gardramon ends up trying to stop him and Androm Andromon, getting annoyed, steps on him and deactivates him or destroys him for good. Mimi upset to see how Gardramon, who put his life on the line for Mimi and the others despite knowing having a little small spotlight, gets a really upset and angry of what Andromon did. This allows um, Palmon to actually evolve, I mean Palmon from Togemon to evolve into Lilymon. And by that time, um, we have to that Lilymon would use her spores to mess up Andromon's machine, machine, machine specs whatsoever, and eventually um, ends up using Flower Cannon to like defeat Andromon, pure release him from the mind control, but unfortunately for him, the effect of um, Palamon's flower cannon ends up turning him into a plant or something, or just stops him right in the mid-tracks. Mimi, upset to see Gardramon having to be destroyed or defeated or dead, cries in despair, realizing he he is no longer with them, you know? And decides to like um, place the, the same little flower that Gardramon offered to Mimi as a saying, hello, or, or how you doing, this is me, how, how to be a friend, you know, kind of thing. And we have to it that eventually um, that Izzy gives the information to Tai Chi that Andromon and Gardramon were, were good allies until Andromon was manipulated by a sound Bergermon and caused a lot of havoc, you know. And because of that, this this encourages Mimi to to Palmon that we got like end the bad guys and return home soon, so none of this happens ever again. Preview next episode. I can't wait for that one too. I mean, like um. Even though, like I said, the reboot is a little bit different from the original, it has to be a little bit different anyway, but looking forward to the next episode because, you know, yeah. Anyways, um, if I remember correctly, the symbol that Mimi represented that allowed pa Togemon to evolve is a, is a 
possibly crest of purity i believe i don't know I, I think i think that's the case yeah i think yeah it's pretty much like um the crest of purity that allowed mimi's um togemon to evolve to lilymon you know and that is actually very important for mimi i mean like um, it may seem like um it may not seem a lot or something but um it actually rep it represents possibly part of mimi and what she has to be you know i mean like um the, the name Purity is enough. I mean, I mean, the Crest of Purity re was shown in the original original series of Digimon, and now it showed up in here, but in a different kind of form. Just a little minor spoiler, by the way, but yeah. That aside, um, looking forward to the next episode, and hopefully it'll be exciting, you know? So until then, people, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm Alpha Zero. Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, alright? Peace out. Bye-bye. Toot-toot-toot!